This is ESPN Cricket for top action of the day, powered by Star Sports. I'm Rana Kapoor with Ajit Agarkar, and we're delighted that we have a test match on our hands that's at least uh, in the balance, if not just uh, with India, their noses ahead. It was South Africa's day, day three. Let's uh, look at our uh, top action of the day. And session number one, Dean Elga, who continues his uh, grinding effort against uh, India from the series in South Africa. Fine knock and a good mix, Ajit, of caution and aggression. We saw the aggression when he took on Ravindra Jadeja for 16 runs in what was the 44th over. And that summed up how he did uh, take on India spinners more often than not. Yeah, and very unusual for mm. a batsman uh, like him who usually grinds his innings out, uh, which was a real positive. Trusted, trusted his shot-making ability because he trusted what was happening uh, from the pitch. It's still a slow pitch. It's not. It is spinning, but not as as much as India would have hoped it would in the third day. So, uh, trusted his ability to actually hit over the top. Even even balls which were you know on off stump or even sometimes from the off spinner, which were pitching on middle and off, he still went over uh, mid on at times. So, uh, yeah, look. Brilliant innings uh, under the circumstances for South, South yeah. Africa. And a fitting way to bring up a 100 for Dean Elga, as much as he grinds his way through through the large part of his test cricket. But he managed to uh, get uh, his 100 with a 6. So that's what we'll focus on, the second session of play. Dean Elga with a 100, that meant a lot to him. And there aren't too many of these around anymore, Ajit. The specialised test batsmen that just play the longer format. And it's nice to see that even away from home, Dean Elgar is just reinforcing the value he has. Yeah, absolutely. I think even those uh, traditional batsmen have started to hit in the air now. <laughs> uh, getting hundreds of by hitting sixes. But look, he needed to put pressure on Indian bowling. Uh, that's exactly what he did. Even even towards the close of that second day, he came down the pitch and hit, hit one yeah. in the air, which usually you don't associate with, uh, you know, travelling batsmen or overseas players who come, don't want to necessarily put pressure and try and defend their way through it. This was the ideal sort of mix uh, of defence and attack. It's still a decent pitch to bat on, but uh, they had to play well because there were two quality spinners uh, that they had to face uh, throughout yeah. the day. And uh, Elgar obviously led from the front. Mm, and finally, in the final session of play, well done to India to at least get Dean Elgar. It's a Dean Elgar special, this segment, because our final bit of action is Dean Elgar's wicket. And it was uh, Ravindra Jadeja's 200. So we're going to focus on that. And a small matter of also focusing on the catch that gave Jadeja that 200th wicket from Cheteshwar Pujara. But well done to Jadeja, who's now become the fastest left-hand bowler to 200 test wickets in just uh, 44 games. Some achievement, a large part of those wickets in India, of course, and whatever said about the pitches. Uh, thoughts on Jadeja? Yeah, incredible. I think mm. uh, it's hard enough getting one test wicket. To get 200 is an incredible achievement. Yes, there have been pitches which have been helpful. Uh, but that's been the case before as well. I yes. mean, when you travel overseas, the pitches do help the seam bowlers. Uh, and usually you see seamers from uh, overseas have better records. So, uh, you still have to bowl well. You still have to have the necessary quality to do it. Uh, and he's done it over a period of time. I think 200 test wickets uh, is a phenomenal achievement. Yes, he's, you know, he's a bit different mm -hmm. to Ashwin where he does require help from the pitch. Uh, but once you have that, he's as good as anyone in the world. Is that the best catch Pujara will ever take <laughs> in his career? I, I think a, a fellow Saurashtra guy, yeah. he made sure it's that... It's a made uh, in Saurashtra yeah, wicket. Like lovely catch, uh, had to judge it, had to get to that quickly. Uh, and uh, an important one as well, yeah. because at that point, uh, uh, Elgar and uh, Dikok bat for a bit longer. India could uh, have been put under a bit more pressure. All right. Thank you very much, Ajit Agarkar. So, it was an action-packed day. It saw Dean Elgar at his best, Quintin Dikok at his best, and a milestone for Ravindra Jadeja. This sums up our ESPN Cricket for top action of the day, powered by Star Sports.